My work has been always on researching air pollution in Beirut. And for the past uh, five years, I have been more uh, in touch with the uh, community, trying to assess what they need and how to tailor my research in order for it to attend to the needs of the local communities. I have been so angry about the politician and I have been also an activist on the ground, trying to stop them from killing us from all the poison that have been emitted due to their negligence. And my most recent, recent activism before the blast is their idea, their crazy idea, to get incinerators into the country so that if there is anybody who can escape cancer, will die from cancer for sure. And so Khadid Beirut was created to counteract this, to say, we exist, we know how to do it, we have the know-how, we have the expertise, and we know how to fix our country. We are more than 100 plus experts who decided to say enough is enough. Those people do not represent us and little by little we think we can build the country that represents us. We tried to, as much as possible to intervene in order to address the priority issues uh, that resulted from the blast. So uh, Dr. Najat Saliba, Dr. Carmen Jaha and Dr. Nuha Dumit got in touch with me and they asked me if I want to participate in the Community Health Initiative. So we have uh, uh, professionals from the International Lebanese Medical Association, the ILMA, and we are uh, from Lebanon, we are physicians, nurses, healthcare professionals, computer scientists, uh, uh, public health uh, experts. We came together in order to think and plan for evidence-based programs to address the priority issues of our communities. So access to healthcare care services is really essential. We see people who are on chronic diseases and they are, they are not being seen by any specialist for like more than a year and this is not acceptable. We also see patients who, are, who have immediate needs like for, for treatment, acute, acute diseases and they cannot afford it, it's very expensive. Therefore, what we're trying to do is to reach out to whoever can donate for us so that we can cover for their medications, for their consultations, and even for hospitalizations to cover their fees. So we said let's divide ourselves into those four main areas, or we call them four main impact initiatives. And we called upon our colleagues who did not hesitate to say, I know how to do it in the health sector, I know how to do it in education, I know how to do it in environment, and I know how to do it in the small and medium businesses. And we started working on four parallel lines. And we will rebuild Beirut, but we want to build it in our own way, not in the foreign aids way. Those corrupt people in power do not represent us. We will stay and we will tell the world who we are and how we want to rebuild our country. We are going to stay and we are going to rebuild it. They have to leave, not us.